how to see the bloom effect in the 3D viewport than using the EV render easily. Let's dive in. If you like, you can download and use this stylized sword model I've shown you via the Gumroad link I've shared. Alternatively, we can set up a simple scene with cubes, assign a material with a high emission value to a few of them, and continue from there. It's totally up to you. Also, let's not forget to set our render engine to EV in the render tab. In the good old days, we had a direct volume option under the EV render engine. I guess I'm getting old. Anyway, let's get back to work. Let's also make sure we are in the render shading mode within the 3D viewport. Let's continue our explanation with our cute little sword. Let's add a camera to our scene, align it to where we want to see the bloom effect, and then quickly render by pressing the F12 shortcut key on the keyboard. Now, we'll go to the compositing tab, click the use notes checkbox, and from there, we can see the render we took and adjust our bloom effect however we want. Now, we'll add a glare node from the Shift A menu and change the glare type to blue. You can tweak your values on the glare node however you like. Now, to see our bloom effect directly in the scene, all we need to do is open the viewport shading menu in the top right corner and select always from the compositor section. That's it. And not to lose the video, hit the like button. And don't hesitate to share your thoughts with me in the comment section. Hasta luego.